very relieved. What's my agenda of the day? Well, I'm going to be firstly finishing off with the edit of my video. Um, only a little bit is left, just a little bit of tweaking here and there. After which I'm going to be cleaning my room. My room has been dirty for ages now. I'd rather have it clean before my mom kicks me out of the house. So I'm going to be cleaning my room and you're going to be seeing all of it the mess and then the cleanliness that's for now uh, after which i will definitely head for my workout today is my favorite day it's the back day but for now it's some breakfast time so there you go 34 grams of kellogg special k with uh, muesli adding some vanilla soul fills yeah and some skim milk I think I should finish editing before uh, lunch time uh, and then I can have some sumptuous meal and then with a lot of energy get on to the cardio work that is the cleaning of my room The bottom rack needs to be stacked yet neatly. Things are going in slowly and steadily. There you go. So yes, cleaning is in progress. Please do not disturb. Uh, running absolutely late to the gym. I hope I can finish my workout. I know there's no light right now. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah, there's some light here. For now, I'm gonna head to my workout. I'll see you later. Bye. Welcome to my workout of shoulder and arms. I started off by warming up my upper body muscles first. I usually use the Reebok resistance band to warm up my shoulders. I actually have a weak right shoulder. I had an injury uh, on it before and hence I make sure that I do an intense warm up for my shoulders specifically. Uh, otherwise during my workout it starts to hurt and that's why I also go light when it comes to my shoulder and arms workout. So as you saw I first started off with a shoulder press using the dumbbell. I did 4 sets with a rep range of 15, 12, 10 and 15. Obviously as the sets progressed the weight of the dumbbell also increased. The last set I usually take similar weight as that of the first set in order to do a higher rep range and then I went on to do the bicep curl on the machine and I'm in love with this machine because of the concentration it provides to the biceps I did 4 sets again of 15, 12, 12 and 15 counts each the last few reps of each set I kept the range of motion inwards to feel the pinch post the biceps I did the tricep push down on the cable an absolutely excellent variation to this is using the rope. Here I did 3 sets of 15, 12 and 12 each and the 4th set was a drop set where I dropped from 70 to 50 to 30 pounds. And then I went on to doing the lateral raises. 
So the lateral raise I feel is the best exercise to define your shoulders. For me, due to my injury, I lift light, but I go heavy on the reps. You could see me doing a single hand lateral raise of 12 counts each, and I added a superset of both arms of five counts each, and I did both of these things together. Moving on to the biceps again, I did the bicep rope curl. The reason I love the rope so much is because it requires more effort and it definitely helps uh, in the desired results. I did four sets of 15, 12, 12 and 15 counts each. If in case your gym doesn't have the rope, you could always do a hammer curl instead. Further on, I went on to doing the tricep push down. My body weight seems too light, hence the machine proves to be way more intense while I work out my triceps. Then I did the shoulder upright cable row exercise but due to lack of time I could just do two sets but it was good enough to feel the pinch and last but not the least was the high cable rear delt rope pull it is a great movement to target the rear delts well if you want to develop a rounder more muscular set of shoulders while improving your posture and decreasing injury risk at the same time some direct rear deltoid exercise should definitely be included as a part of your training program so guys that sums up today's workout i hope it proved to be informative stay on and enjoy the rest of the video Line this creep while you and me repeat this bit of sweet heat is suffocating And always hesitating Kryptonite desires set my heart afire Heart on fire Set my heart afire workout and uh, heading back home now it's 11 pm sharp had an amazing workout today this is the first time that i'm so shredded and i'm really glad about it i think my uh, transformation is literally visible to me well i'm having my protein shake dimatize elite chocolate cake batter it tastes yum cafe mocha is awesome but this is even better according to me So I would give this a 9.5 on 10 and uh, you should definitely try it out. You know you should go back to the gym now. You don't look sleepy, you don't look tired, nothing. I wish the gym was open. Yeah, the gym shut at 11. Like vlog, bro. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, I wish the gym stop it. Let me vlog. Okay guys, uh, we're heading back home. Now I'm going to be dropped and then uh, I will see you at home and I want to watch her vlog